welcome back to Rod Todd's Garage, episode two. Well, as you can see, we're taking apart the 84 Silverado. Remember, the 84 Silverado found in a field out in West Texas. And what we're doing is we're going through the whole truck. It's called the road to Mecham. So what we want to do is get the truck done and prepped. Mecham is in September. Hopefully, we're going to run it through the auction and see what it brings. Now, remember, our main focus is to redo all the running systems, the driving systems on it, make sure that you can take this to a car show, swap meet, have a good time with it. The white on the bottom and the white on the roof is going to get redone. That'll look brand new. And I'm kind of a patina guy, so we want to make sure the old beige stays right there. They're only original ones, and patina's in right now because honestly, if I go to a swap meet or car show, I want to be able to put my beer down on it, have a good time with the guys. So let's walk through the truck. As you can see, I just took off the uh, upper drip rail molding off of the cab because we're going to be painting that cab. So we've been going through the inside. Inside is really, really ratty, but we've got new carpeting coming. We've got brand new seat. We're going to change it out to cloth. We've got a brand new headliner, brand new dash pad, brand new dash insert. Inside's going to look like brand new. As we walk around the truck, you know you guys watch Velocity, you watch Motor Trend TV, and what's the most important thing when you're taking apart a truck like this is organization. Any car or any truck, you want to make sure that you've got all your nuts and bolts in the proper spot. So what's an easier way to do that? Grab the old Ziploc bag and some post-it notes. Right there, drip rail molding bolts. So as you can see, we've got some stuff taken apart on the truck already. We've got bags for the mirror bolts, headlight bezels, we've got the tail lights out of it. Uh, we've got their wheel lip moldings up there, we've got the grill out of it. Let's take a walk around the other side of the truck. Our main focus right now is what we want to do is we want to get this thing up on jack stands, take the wheels and tires off of it, and what we want to do is we're going to power wash everything. This old back window, this needs to come out of the truck. Somebody put a piece of plexiglass possibly out of a fish tank in it. That needs to come out. we got a brand new sliding back window. We've already got the door panel off of it. And we're going to go back with the original wheels and tires on this. We're going to use the GM rail wheels. Classic look, whether it's on the old 60s and 70s muscle cars. These square body wheels, everybody loves these square body wheels. we got a brand new set of white letter tires going on it. This side, we've, we've made some, a lot of progress on already. Mirrors off it, drip rail moldings off of it. We had some body side moldings that were peeling off of it. Wheel lip moldings are off. And as we walk around the front, we've already got the grill and the headlights out of it. We need to straighten up that front bumper. That front bumper is going to end up coming off also. So I want to thank you for watching. Tune in next time. Rod Todd's Garage, Road to Mecham on the 84 Silverado. Thank you and have a great day.